Terrifier 3 director Damien Leone just shared on his Instagram story a very interesting video that just might confirm my craziest threequel theory. Let's talk a little bit about that. <laughs> Welcome to the Killjoy Jake YouTube channel. My name is Lauren, and today we're talking a little bit about Terrifier 3. Now, for those who don't know, all the way back in late January, early February, Terrifier 3 began production. As of recording this video, they are still in production for Terrifier 3, but probably should be wrapping soon. The film releases on October 25th of this year, the same day that Lee Winnell's Wolfman is supposed to come out, so we're gonna have ourselves a crazy horror double feature that day. I'm calling it Wolf of Fire 3. But today's Terrifier 3 update comes from writer-director Damien Leone, who shared a video of a crowd of people in what appears to be a shopping mall watching their shoot. The video was captioned, we had an audience today with the clown and Christmas tree emoji. Hashtag Terrifier 3. Now a theory that I've been pitching for a very long time on this page is that Art the Clown would go into a shopping mall and chop off Santa's face. And oddly enough, there are a lot of reasons to assume that this will happen in Terrifier 3. If it's because of the poster right back here, where he's literally wearing Santa's face around his neck, or the fact that this is a Christmas movie, maybe the fact that Art the Clown is wearing Santa's costume in the teaser trailer, ladies and gentlemen. Where did he get that costume? Actually, you know, a bigger question is how did he grow his body back after the ending of Terrifier 2? All things that need to be answered in the third film. But ladies and gentlemen, I think this theory is all but confirmed at this point. Why else would they be at a shopping mall? I can picture the scene now. A mall Santa sitting there, probably drunk off his ass, with a long long line of excited kids and tired parents. There's a beautiful Christmas tree behind the guy in this grandiose looking shopping mall, and Art the Clown decides to pay Santa a visit. Dude takes out his scalpel, starts sawing off Santa's face in front of a bunch of children who start crying. I mean, if that's not the big scene of this movie, I don't know what is. Now, the one monkey wrench that a lot of you guys like to throw at that theory is that Art the Clown is going to kill the real Santa real Santa, specifically the one who lives in the North Pole who makes toys for kids all around the world. I personally feel like that's a little too far of a stretch, even for a Terrifier film. I know we introduced supernatural elements in the previous movie, but that's taken a step too far in my opinion. A little sprinkle of schlock is okay, but when you throw a little too much of that in there, it just becomes nonsense. I mean, come on, like is Sienna gonna use the power of Christmas to fight Art the Clown? That so does not fit in this franchise. But Art the Clown walking into a shopping mall to kill a vagabond mall Santa is the vibe. I personally just can't see them taking it that far down that road. Although, it probably would be a really funny bit to see Art the Clown ripping off Rudolph's nose. But what do you all think about this crazy theory? Do you think that Art the Clown is going after a mall Santa specifically to cut off his face? Do you think he's going after the real Santa Claus? Or do you think that video that Damien Leone posted is just not enough proof quite yet? Leave me something about it in the comments below. Thank you all so much for watching this brand new Terrifier 3 update. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more horror movie content in the future. Please consider supporting me on Patreon as well if you want to support this channel further. You can do so by clicking that link in the description below. Thank you all again for watching, and as always, don't forget to kill it out there, y'all.